The portrait of Dirk Van Oss is a later painting by Rembrandt, 1606-1669, created circa 1658. It is currently in the permanent collection of the Jocelyn Art Museum in Omaha, Nebraska. In 1898, the portrait was acquired by a New York art dealer from a private collector in St. Petersburg, Russia. In 1899, the portrait was sold to Boston businessman Frederick Sears. The painting was purchased by the Jocelyn Museum in 1942 from a private collection. Initially believed to have been painted by Rembrandt himself, the painting was later reclassified as a painting from the school of Rembrandt, the likely work of one of Rembrandt's students. In the spring of 2012, under the guidance of Ernst van de Vetering, one of the world's foremost authorities on Rembrandt, the museum sent the painting to Amsterdam for further study and treatment. Martin Bale, former head of restoration, at the Rijksmuseum in Amsterdam, worked with van de Wetering on the painting's conservation. The determination that the painting was a true Rembrandt, was made during the conservation process. The subject depicted in the painting is Dirk van Os III, 1590 1668, a prominent Dutch citizen. He was the son of Dirk van Os, Antwerp March 13, 1556, Amsterdam May 20, 1615, an Amsterdam merchant, insurer, financier, and ship owner. The elder van Os was one of the founders of the Compagnie van Ver, the Amsterdam Exchange Bank and the United East India Company, VOC. The painting shows Van Oss as an elderly man, seated holding a cane in his left hand, donning a black robe with white collar and cuffs, and wearing a cap. During the restoration process, it was determined that later additions to the painting included lace around the collar and a chain with a cross hanging from the subject's neck. The embellishments were removed during the restoration process that the restored painting was unveiled in the Jocelyn Art Museum's Hitchcock. Foundation Gallery on May 5, 2014 and is part of the museum's permanent collection. In November 2016 the Jocelyn Art Museum unveiled a newly commissioned frame for the painting. The painting was originally displayed in an ornate gilded Louis XIV frame, which framed the portrait when it was acquired by the museum in 1942. The new frame is less ornate. The frame, as described by the Jocelyn's Associate Curator of European Art, it is a restrained style. A framing that corresponds with the conservative Protestant sensibility of the age into the strong mercantile culture of the Netherlands, which profited from importing exotic woods through the Dutch East India Company. The frame was paid for by the Jocelyn Art Museum Association.